friends let's discuss the following question it says if three lines whose equations are y is equal to m1x plus c1 y is equal to m2x plus c2 and y is equal to m3x plus c3 are concurrent then show that m1 into c2 minus c3 plus m2 into c3 minus c1 plus m3 into c1 minus c2 is equal to 0 before moving on to the solution first understand the basic approach to solve this question we are given that the three lines are concurrent that means they pass through one point that means the three lines intersect at one point so we'll first find the intersection point of any two lines and since the three lines are given to be concurrent third line will also pass through the point of intersection of the two lines keeping this approach in mind let us now move on to the solution we are given three lines y is equal to m1x plus c1 and y is equal to m2x plus c2 now we find point of intersection of these two lines let's call this as 1 and this as 2 now subtract 2 from 1 we have y is equal to m1x plus c1 y is equal to m2x plus c2 subtracting we get 0 is equal to m1 minus m2 x plus c1 minus c2 and this implies x is equal to minus c1 minus c2 upon m1 minus m2 now we put x is equal to minus c1 minus c2 upon m1 minus m2 in any one of the two equations equation 1 or equation 2 so let's put it in equation 1 so we have y is equal to m1 into x that is minus minus c1 minus c2 upon m1 minus m2 plus c1 so this implies minus m1 into c1 minus c2 plus c1 into m1 minus m2 upon m1 minus m2 is equal to m3 into x which is minus of c1 minus c2 upon m1 minus m2 plus c3 and this implies minus m1 into c1 minus c2 plus c1 into m1 minus m2 is equal to minus m3 into c1 minus c2 plus c3 into m1 minus m2 we just took the lcm and cancelled m minus and this implies y is equal to minus m1 into c1 minus c2 plus c1 into m1 minus m2 upon m1 minus m2 by taking the lcm therefore the point of intersection of the line 1 and 2 is minus of c1 minus c2 upon m1 minus m2 and minus m1 into c1 minus c2 plus c1 into m1 minus m2 
upon m1 minus m2. Let's call this as A. Now the third equation of the line is given to us as y is equal to m3x plus c3. Now we are given that the three lines are concurrent. Concurrent means they pass through one point. That means the third line passes through the point of intersection of the line 1 and 2. That means A satisfies the equation of the third line. So we put X is equal to minus of C1 minus C2 upon M1 minus M2 and Y is equal to minus M1 into C1 minus C2 plus C1 into M1 minus M2 upon M1 minus M2 in 3. So we have minus M1 into C1 minus C2 plus C1 into M1 minus M2 upon M1 minus M2 is equal to M3 into X which is minus of C1 minus C2 upon M1 minus M2 plus C3. Now this implies minus M1 into C1 minus C2 plus C1 into M1 minus M2 upon M1 minus M2 is equal to minus M3 into C1 minus C2 plus C3 into M1 minus M2 upon M1 minus M2. Now we cancel M1 minus M2 from the both sides in the denominator we have minus M1 into C1 minus C2 plus C1 into M1 minus M2 is equal to minus M3 into C1 minus C2 plus C3 into M1 minus M2. Now this implies minus M1 into C1 minus C2 plus C1 into M1 minus M2 plus M3 into C1 minus C2 minus C3 into M1 minus M2 is equal to 0. Now this can be further written as M1 into C2 minus C1 taking minus sign common plus C1 into M1 minus M2 plus M3 into C1 minus C2 plus C3 into M2 minus M1 is equal to 0. And this again implies M1 into C2 minus C1 plus C1 minus C3. We are just collecting the terms with M1. Now we collect the terms with M2. This M2 into minus C1 plus C3. Now we collect the terms with M3. So M3 into C1 minus C2. And this is equal to 0. Now this is again equal to M1 into C2 minus C3 plus M2 into C3 minus C1 plus M3 into C1 minus C2 is equal to 0. And this is what we have to prove. Hence the result is proved. 
So this completes the question. Hope you enjoyed the session. Goodbye and take care.